This is the home that I grew up in along with my younger sister, Yama. Uh, we grew up in this home um, after we moved from Walton Way. We moved here. This I remember sitting out on the front. This was before it looked like this though. Playing jacks. Kids don't play jacks anymore. It's just simple fun games, you know. We used to do that, sit out here and play jacks. And, um, of course, ride our bikes. And dad had, my mom and dad had lots of dogs because uh, my mom loved pets. This is the home that dad wanted to make a museum. Um, he cherished his home. He never wanted to live in Hollywood or any other place. He wanted to stay right here where he was born, South Carolina, and where he grew up in South Carolina and Augusta. And this is the home that he wanted to share with his fans one day. And that's what we continue to fight for so that those wishes that he wanted for his home to be a, a museum could, could be that, just that. And his fans from all over the world could come and see how the Godfather sold Mr. James Brown, how he lived and experienced the peace that he experienced on this property. And of course, this is the home that Tommy Ray and him were married in. It, it looked like this when they were married. Um, and they were married in the theater over on the other side over there. It's really funny because that used to be the garage, okay, where that big square is. And that, um, of course, where I used to keep my go-kart, <laughs> my training tool. Um, but when he converted it, he converted it and made it uh, his hair salon. So that's where he would get his hair done. But he put that kind of, he wanted that kind of window up there so that he could always see who was coming up to the house. And when he was in there getting his hair done, everything faced that window. So um, if you were coming up, and you were trying to ease up and thinking that he might be in the house not looking out, if he was sitting in there, he could see everything and you couldn't see anything. 